do not judge me because I beat you up 10 years ago because you aren't really doing a good job, sis. You know, and everybody don't be there, so I'm happy that I'm in that place where I can do that. But it's so many dope people in Cleveland. We don't, it's like a, a, a competition. And everybody, if we come together, it'll be so much better. Yeah. Like, I meet so many dope women. Me and y'all here, too. I see y'all in the crash. Y'all dope, too. But it's a lot of women that are just over the top. Like, I meet people every day. And then it's like, they don't even want to talk about how dope they are. You know, like, oh, girl, you know I got a little clothing line. A little clothing line. You've been doing this for four some years and yada, yada, this. So I think that we all need to just celebrate each other more. Stop being so competitive. Stop holding on to stuff from back in the days. Like I said, I, I see people, I seen the girl at the mall, I, I thought after 20 years we was good. But I'm like, hey girl, and she's like, Tch. and I'm like, you still on that? Like, okay, all right. But that's a lot of people is still on that. So for the people that's not still on that, we should want to celebrate each other, want to hug each other, want to tell somebody you're doing good. You know, because we be needing, I know I be all over the place. So when, from where I came from, from a whole bunch of bad things to changing my life to trying to do good, people come to me like, you motivate me. Like, who, me? Not me, not Stoney that used to be doing this and doing this and, oh, I motivate you now? So now I want to motivate more people and I want to be more motivated. So every day I try to get myself together, change it. I like meeting women who is willing to say, you know what, you need to do this. Or you need to stop doing this. Or you know what I'm saying? That's what I want. People, but like, I need the whole bag, okay? So I, I told y'all my light bill ain't going nowhere. So um, I'm excited to host. I'm excited that everybody came out. I'm really excited about all the people on the panel. Like I said, Jamila called me and was asking me about uh, so many different people and I was like, Girl, I know so many dope people. And when I saw the lineup, I'm like, it knows it's them. Like, yeah, that's them. And then she brought some more people. I'm like, it's just so good to even see, like, and talk to the people from out in Philly. Like, yo, I started my line. I'm the, I'm the largest urban brand in Philly. Like, wow, and you look just like me. Dang, so, and you look just like me. Like, that, I mean, it, I, I just be motivated by women. I've always been this way. If people know me from school, I've always been always on women like i don't like women like that baby you know i'm just saying i always like dope people because i always felt like i was dope and i didn't care what nobody else said about me when they said oh you this oh you this when i went to prison oh girl she in prison finally and all the stuff i got back up like and now i'm the owner of a radio station because i don't want to go back and once again thanks for my issue for coming up here because like i said it's good to hear these stories because in my eyes, I be thinking everybody is perfect. You can't tell me nothing wrong about Maisha, okay? So, um, now.